This is cardio. This is your time for you. This is your 15 minutes. We're going to get started with our warm up in three, two, one. We're jogging on the spot. Let's go. So we're just warming up. Bit of a jog on the spot just to get our body moving, get that blood flowing. Got a lot of exercises coming up, so I'm going to make sure we're nice and warm. That's the way. Keep going. 10 seconds to go and then we're on to star jumps. Keep it going. In three, two, one, star jumps. Arms out horizontal. Jump out and in. Make sure you're activating your glute when your toes touch on the way out. If you want to, you can take away the jump and you can just step it. But make sure you pick up the pace so you're getting your heart going. Keep going, jump or step, whatever suits you and go at your own pace. All right, we're on to knees up, three, two, one. Knees up, it's just a step or a march, whatever you wanna call it. Use your abs to drive your knee up. Remember, we're just warming up here. So I want you to go at your pace. You don't wanna wear yourself out in the warm up. Keep going. That's the way, 10 seconds to go. And then we're back to our jog on the spot. Three, two, one, and run. Try and pick up the pace a little bit. Really get our body moving. You should feel yourself warming up. Really push out of the balls of your feet and move those arms. That's the way. 10 seconds, and then we're back to our star jumps. Remember, horizontal arms. In three, two, one, go. Star jumps. Activate your glute. Try and keep your elbows up so your hands are just going out and in. That's right. Remember, you can step as well if you want to. Go at your pace. This is just the warm up, remember. <laughs> Keep it going, 10 seconds to go. And three, two, one, back to our march, knees all the way up. If you're feeling a bit warm, then you can turn it into a run instead. Really push out of the ball of your foot, drive that knee up, activating your core. Keep it going. 10 seconds to go. Then we'll get a little rest before we start the real thing. <laughs> Three, two, one, and rest. Shake it out, have a quick stretch, quad stretch, hamstring stretch, whatever you want, because in 20 seconds, we're starting first off with side shuttle. So I'll show you how it goes. Shuttle, touch your knee. Shuttle, touch your knee. So it's two skips to the side and touch knee. That's why keep stretching. <laughs> Make sure you're nice and warm. Three, two, one, shuttle, touch. Shuttle, touch. That's the way. Go at your pace. It might take a little bit to coordinate the steps, but I'm sure you'll get it. <laughs> Keep going, 15 seconds. If you can, try and pick up the pace. Sometimes it's actually easier to coordinate if you keep moving through it a little bit quicker. Good job. All right, three, two, one, lunge. So we're gonna lunge forwards and lunge back. Lunge forwards and lunge back. Start with whichever leg you like first. Good job. Keep going. We're going to swap legs in 10 seconds. Keep chest up. Push out of your heel. That's the way. Three, two, one. Other leg. I'll show you from the side. So we step, push out of your heel and back. Make sure you keep your chest up. Use your core to keep yourself stable. Hips stay on top. Keep going, woo. 
Keep it going. Nearly there. You've got 10 seconds to go. Forwards and back. You've got a 15 second rest after this. Three, two, one, and rest. 15 seconds. Breathe it in. We've got drop squats next. So we start feet together, drop down, jump feet back together. Drop down, ready? Three, two, one, go. Down, feet together. Down, feet together. Go at your pace. If you want to take away the jump, you can do it as a step. So just step to the side and squat. Same thing, press back into your heels, draw your belly button in, keep your chest up nice and tall. 20 seconds to go. If you can, try and push it out. We really want to get our cardio up, so keep pushing through for the last 10 seconds. Then we are on the floor. We have push-ups in three, two, one, on the floor. Knees on the ground, shoulders on top of your wrist, press down, push back up. Press down, push back up. If you want to, you can try and do it without your knees on the ground. Go all the way down, all the way up. Make sure either way that you do it, you don't have your bottom stick in the air or you're not sagging through the middle. So tuck your bottom under, keep your core activated. All right, we're back on our feet. We are up to side shuttle again. Tap, shuttle, tap. That's the way. This is where you're going to really get your heart rate up. We had a little bit of a rest in the push-ups from our movements. Now I want you to pick up the pace. Keep going. 10 seconds to go. We're back on the floor. We've got floor sprints. But for now, I want you to push that last five seconds out. That's the way. Three, two, one. Down we go on the floor. We're going to use our abs to pull our knee in and run. We're keeping our cardio going here. Drive it in. Make sure your bottom's not in the air or you're not sagging through the middle. Keep pushing. You've got 10 seconds to go and then you have 15 second rest. Keep going. And three, two, one, rest. Have a breather. Should be feeling a little bit sweaty, a little bit out of breath. But that's good. I want you to keep pushing through with me. But remember, you do it at your pace. You don't do it at my pace. So what suits you? Right, wide feet burpees. So hands go down, step out, step in and up. Down, step out, step in, up. If you want to pick it up, you can turn it into a jump. So jump out, step in, jump up. Down, jump out, step in, up. Keep it going, 20 seconds to go. Do it as a step or do it as a jump, whatever suits you. Make sure you're going through the full range of movement. Keep pushing through, five seconds, we have another rest. Down, in, up, rest. Good job, we got a 30 second rest this time. And then. Next exercise is running butt kicks. So we're on the spot, you're gonna use your hamstring to pull your heel to your butt, okay? Are you ready? Got 15 seconds to go. Grab some water, have a stretch out, whatever you need to do. All right, in 10 seconds. Shake it out. So we wanna stay on the balls of our feet here, okay? We're gonna bounce, pull our heel to our bottom. Ready, go. <laughs> We're keeping our heart rate up. So we had a rest. We let our heart rate drop back a little bit. We're going to shoot it back through the roof again. Okay, make sure you use your arms. 15 seconds to go. Then we're going to turn it into a scissor. So we've got a couple of cardios in this next little section to keep that heart rate going and really get that fitness. In three, two, one, scissor. Feet forwards and backwards. Keep chest up, keep your belly button drawn into your spine so your core is activated the whole time. Make sure both heels touch the floor with each step. 
10 seconds to go. Then we have side sprint into scissor. Keep moving. I'll show you how, as we go. Two, one, go. Side sprint and five scissors. Five, four, two, one. Side sprint and scissor. Five, three, two, one. Go at your pace, but I just want you to try and keep moving here. Okay? Keep moving. Five, four, two, one. Remember, you don't have to go at my pace. You're going at your pace. That's the way. Sprint it out. 15 seconds to go. We have a 15 second rest. I've pushed out your cardio here, so you deserve that rest. Keep going. And three, two, one, rest. Have a breather. Then we're on the floor, we've got frog runs. I want you to focus on using your obliques in this to pull your knee around to the side. Are we ready? We're on the floor. Feet together, turn knee out, pull to your elbow. Knee out, pull to your elbow. I'll show you front on so you can see my knee turned out. Turned out, pull. Use your obliques to pull it up. Keep going. Good job. You got five more seconds. And three, two, one, on your feet for hurdle hops. So we're gonna drive up, but we're not gonna disconnect off the floor. Drive up, make sure you use your core to pull your knee up. Your hand and your knee are at the highest point together. If you wanna hop into it, you can hop into it. Otherwise, keep it as a march. In five seconds, we're back on the floor. Ready? Three, two, one, down we go. Now front support, we're gonna step in, step out. Step in, step out. Make sure you alternate legs each time. If you want to, you can try and do it with a bit of a jump. So step out, jump in, step back. Or you can step in and jump back. Do whatever suits you. You're moving and that's a good thing. Oh, we're back on our feet and we have running butt kicks again. Ready? Push through the ball of your foot and really get your heel to your butt using your hamstring. Keep it going. Good job. We've got 10 seconds to go. We're on to our last exercise after this. Are you ready? In three, two, one, and sprint on the spot and drop into a squat hold. That's the way. Sprint on the spot, drop into squat hold. Make sure you're listening because I may change hold. I may change it on you. So keep going, keep running. That's the way, and hold. Good job. Run, hold. Excellent, make sure you've got the weight in your heels. Chest up tall, belly button drawn in. Keep it going, we've got 30 seconds to go. Hold. Try to pick up the pace for this last 25 seconds. Hold. Good job, hold. Gotcha, keep going. <laughs> Run it through. We got 15 seconds, hold. Good, hold it there, keep going, and run. And hold, that's the way, one last one. Hold, three, two, one, good job. Grab a drink if you need to, we're gonna have a quick stretch down. So I want you to pull, heel to butt, stretch out that quad. Make sure we're not leaning forward, Keep it up nice and tall and hold. Try and keep your knees together. Oh, I'm sweating. I hope you're sweating as well. <laughs> hold it there. Nice and balanced. That's the way. Let's go feet apart. Big breath in and down. Hold. Stretch those hamstrings. Walk side to side. <laughs> Good job, hip flexor. You can do whatever stretches you want at this point as well. 
might be your groin. I only want 15 minutes of your time, but if you wanna keep stretching, then keep stretching. You've done an awesome job. And remember, it is so important to have this time for you because together we are living the fit life. Good job.